Hi, today I'm going to be showing you how to draw a California poppy. It is our state flower and it's spring, so I thought it would be appropriate. You really just need uh, three tools, paper, pencil, and eraser. You can add color later, and I'm gonna show a video about that in the future, but right now we're just gonna do the drawing part. I found a poppy, and I took a photo of it, and this is the photo that I used to draw this particular poppy. You can use the same concepts for any poppy or any other flower that you see. So this poppy is kind of tilted. So the opening of the flower is going to be a circle, but because it's tilted, it's going to be more like an oval. So you draw the shape of the oval and then the base of the flower is down from the oval and that is basically a circle shape. So you just draw a circle below it. And then you just start with the petals. The first petal is on the left and it's the one that is on the very most outside. So you start at the base and you draw a line that kind of is connecting the base to the opening and it has a little bit of a swoop. So you bend the line in and then you bend it back out and you curve the top of the poppy. That one petal kind of goes down and then from that point right there where the bend of the petal is, you just go back down to where you started that line. Once you have that, then you could add the little detail of the fold at the top. So it folds down and then it kind of has a little texture. That's your first petal. The second one is the one right behind it. So you could see that it kind of comes out a little bit into that first petal we drew and it goes up and it curves around to the end of that oval that we first drew. Comes down and then connects to the first part at the base of the flower. Then there's a little detail fold over. Just draw that. The farthest away petal is behind those two that we just drew. So you add just a little texture because poppies have a little bit of movement. They're not totally smooth. And that petal's done. And the last petal is behind the second one that we drew and there's texture and it comes around almost like a U, but then it dips down right at the end. So it gives it a folding out kind of uh, motion. And then you draw the underside of that petal where you just a little bit in from the bottom of the U that you just made, you bend the line in and then down and connect it to that very first starting point at the base of the flower. That part's done and then we draw the little um, section right below. It's the, the petals growing out from it. And then the stem, it's a little bit wider, barely, at the very top and then it gets narrow as it curves down. Okay, the drawing part is done. We erase the lines. And then we just go over all the lines that we want to keep with a really nice dark pencil or a dark pen if you have a pen handy um, and then you add color.